a fear that's been built up that you have kind of been keeping inside of you. And that moment, suddenly it just comes out. I think that's what's the strongest thing I think away with it is that you're so close to what's common for all of us is to, to stay alive and, and to be alive and to be safe uh, is, is what is an emotion we can all understand. Hi guys! Hey, there's a park about 700 people are saying on board. Yeah. Two pregnant females on it. Do you know what language they speak? Uh, no, there's a Syrian and on the upper leg there's a very good English speaker. We're going back to this part. Yeah. For every rescue, uh, the first thing we do, and I think it's a crucial point, is to go into the rib, um, to get as close as possible to the boat and to get connected with the people and to get their conf confidence, get their trust. Please stay calm. It's very important to stay calm. We will rescue all of you. So we say stay calm. Um, we're taking you to Italy, you're all go going to be fine. Uh, it's like the single most important thing, because if people are calm, everything is done in a much safer way. We could have used the, the, the small rescue boat we had, but it can only fit, uh, what, three more people than in addition to the crew that's already on it, you know? So it would take forever, basically, if we didn't take it alongside. And I, I stayed on the, out, the seaside, staying on, on the rib to continue that conversation and to keep people calm. Calm, calm. Not long time. And at that moment, when you have that connection, uh, I would feel calmer and think, OK, it will, it will be fine. Then it turned out Everything was not uh, so fine. In the beginning, things seemed to be working fairly well. Uh, one, people were coming one by one, more or less, steadily, but there was some fighting, but okay. I mean, people were still coming uh, off the boat. It's like a split second. It goes from being calm, and you think you have a connection with people, and then you can just see they go into survival mode, and you just go for it. The situation got completely out of control and, and people just started jumping off uh, all along, along the fishing boat, just started jumping onto, uh, onto our boat. If someone panics, uh, it takes seconds before a lot of people panic. And then uh, you get into survival mode. And I've never been so close to people who, when you're running, like you're going for your life, you know, I, I need to get out, I need to survive. So at this moment, I just, I, I, we can't, I realize we cannot stop this. Uh, uh, I mean, it's just happening. And, and people were just literally speaking, piling up in the side, uh, sidewalk on the, uh, on the side of the ship. It's a mix of uh, desperation and determination. Uh, and you can really see you cannot reach in. It's, um, it's instinct. It's, I think it's pure instinct. Yalla. 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 And it was, it was so desperate because, you know, you had families where one member of the family, the father, mother, comes onto the, to our ship and then looks back and reaches out to help, you know, their own family member. Of course, they're, they're I mean, <laughs> uh, and then we just had to, you know, usher, push people down and say, go, go, go. And then we would take care of the family member, of course, but it was just, uh, it was just chaos. And then also one, one guy fell into the sea, a big guy. Without, uh, without a life vest, so we were focused on getting him, him out, but he, he didn't panic too much and it was, it was um, quite easy to get him out. It was so close that people uh, either were crushed to death or fell in the water. 
uh, and everyone survived, everyone's safe. Uh, but I was, uh, I was, I think I was a bit shocked actually about what had happened and how how close it was. It's an it's an extraordinary experience. It's it's very intense to be that close to hundreds of people uh, who are desperate to get out of that boat and. It's it's uh, <laughs> and knowing that it's uh, it's my responsibility that that it's this goes okay.